FlexDesk is a simple desk that is designed for the touchscreen to be used in comfort and with ease. I always wanted to have a touchscreen on my desk, just the idea of it was always appealing to me. But it really became a necessity when Windows 8 came out, because it was primarily touch-based. Besides that, I saw every major tech company trending towards the technology. But I have never seen a comfortable way to use a touchscreen on a desk. Just imagine it, keeping your arm suspended every time you wanted to make a selection, and the only way you can write or draw on the screen comfortably is if it is beneath your hand. Initially, writing and drawing were my primary reasons for placing the screen within the desk surface. But during testing, I realized that this position also opened the doors for playing games. Monopoly, chess, and other board games are a click away, and interactive features really bring them to life. Using the screen to compare documents side by side is just a pleasure, and this is just the beginning. I wanted FlexDesk to be something new and exciting, but most importantly, useful every day. The screen should be an extension of the user, and not an obstacle to productivity. Usability and comfort are both the FlexDesk product and model. At the moment I have a working prototype, but it's a little rough around the edges. I have a designer and engineer working out the final design, and as part of the process we are working on automating the removal of the desk surface for the screen to fall into further making the process an easy one. The desk I used to build the prototype most represents what I want from the final design. Although I am happy with the components of the desk, we are still testing other screens and flex arms. Flex desk will be a simple rectangular desk with an adjustable height adding to its flexibility of being used as a conventional desk, a drawing table, or a high or low standing game table. But I am sure that our customers will think of many creative ways to use the flex desk. Leave us a comment and let us know how you would use the flex test.